Hey, what is up guys? Francis here and today I'm gonna be teaching you on how to install EFI or mount EFI partition on Windows 10. Now, the first thing you will need to do is to select your folder. This could be anything, but yeah, just select the folder and then click on manage. Wait for a while. Then after you select manage, go to disk management. Now, remember that this is the disk or the first disk that you're going to be remembering. And then you're also going to be remembering has the status healthy EFI system partition. Now, the next thing you would need to do is to right click on the Windows start thing and then select command prompt admin. Then select yes. After you do that, type disk part to start the disk part, then list disk to list the disk that you can select. Next thing you need to do is then sell, select or SEL disk and then the number zero. After that, cell part one or the first partition in which where you can find the healthy FI system partition, then enter. Next thing we need to do then is type assign. It will then assign a letter for your file or for your system to open. So if you go here in this PC, you will now see the ESP. But for now, you can't open it. So what you do is to install the Explorer++. I will be leaving a link in the description. Then what you need to do is to right click the thing and then run as administrator. Select yes. And there you go. So you can edit things, you can copy things to your boot properties or boot manager system. So you can see here I actually installed, I'm actually dual booting Ubuntu and Microsoft and using Refined as a custom boot manager. So that's it for the video. Hope you enjoy. Leave a like if you find it uh, useful and subscribe for more. See you guys in the next video. Peace out.